Hello and welcome or welcome back to the channel. Today's video is this happened. Yes. <laughs> so um, I was randomly on Amazon and I saw that Art Dot have got four new canvas designs out on there. Um, and so I was super well behaved and only bought three. <laughs> Yay. Well done me. So um, I have definitely failed my low buy this month, but I'm all right with it. I feel like I failed it in a good way. These are ridiculously affordable licensed kits. And these are the pro size, which I've not seen before from them. So they're a much bigger sized version. I think each one is between 15 and 17 pounds, which is a ridiculous amount. I have... Amazon Prime, so they also came like the day after I ordered them for free delivery. So I think I paid about 50 something pounds for all three kits, which is ridiculous. Um, and I figured I will show them to you guys. So there are actually four different designs. There was, um, I think it's a field of sunflowers. I didn't get that one being all super well behaved and don't really not really interested in sunflowers so i'm gonna open these up we're gonna take a look together and we'll see if these are worth grabbing so their pro size is 50 by 70 centimeters if i'm remembering that right so they come in these beautiful, hard, sturdy tubs. They always come completely unblemished because they are so solid. So they turn up beautifully. You've got your really soft canvas kit. A little sticker in between and a little kit for each. They have their legend on the side as they usually do. I'm going to lay this little guy out. oh how cute is he so the first one i got is the panda and um, let's see yep 70 by 50 centimeters or 28 by 20 inches so this is their pro size so you get beginner advanced and pro super cool this is a round um and then oh this is my how beautiful so you get your sticker for your logbook if you like to do that and then we have uh one two three four five ten fifteen twenty twenty five thirty thirty five colors and if i'm not mistaken these rainbow patterns delineate a b colors so one two three four a b's oh hang on this one this one's not sticky so it's 34 colors sorry 34 colours, four of those are A, B, which are, I hope are going to be in the panda. That would be so cute. We'll have a little look. So, you get your little art dot kit, which comes with, they're actually really good little kits. I absolutely love that for the budget price, they don't send you those crappy little trays that nobody really wants. Um, and I do have a few um, of the art dot trays now. I think I have three because I've bought two of their canvases before and their sticker set. Um, have I had something else? And they clip together in a row, which is really cool. They've got these little pour out spouts. They're always in blue. You get your blue pen and your blue squishy. You do get washi tape, which is so nice. And it's the um, quite a thick roll, not, you know, too, too small. This is a beautiful, can you see that? A beautiful white and pink flower that's going to go so well with that. Um, you get your little blue heart wax. A lot of people like the blue. And then what you also get, well, my 
sleeves up out of the way is two of their stickers which these are super fun i've got their big pack of these and i always add my little stickers into my pack and today's is a diamond i love that um if you've not noticed my channel is called diamonds or forever and of course that means that my wax store online is called diamonds or forever wax core um the link is in the description below if you're into wax melts and you live in the UK. Uh, so that is a super good one for my... I think I'm going to make that one up and uh, stick it onto... Uh, I've got my like wax set up off to one side and I've got a big box. So I think I might stick it onto the front. And uh, we've got a rose there. And then we've got... I just, I love the blue and purple colour palette in this. So we've got a really pretty pink AB. I'm seeing some white ABs and quite a lot of them. There's three bags there. Uh, let's see if we can see the others from here. Oh, got a pale pink AB here. If it'll... And then we've got a blue AB, which is a four. Oh. Those are pretty. Um, quite a bit of black, three black, but not too, too much. A lot of dark blue and dark purples, which I like. Oh no, a bit more black. <laughs> black everywhere. Three tens all over the shop. Five three tens bags going on. Quite a lot. I mean, I wouldn't have said the diamond painting was quite that big, but okay. Um, so what I'm going to do, give me one second, we'll move it onto the desk and we will, I know you guys like to see where the ABs are, so one second. Oh, he's beautiful. Um, I wasn't sure if I was going to like him because I don't really do um, animals. I don't know, it's not been my thing, but as if you've watched um, any of my recent videos, I've been trying to make sure I have a bit of everything in my stash so I can actually learn what I love. And I just think he's gonna be gorgeous. So number one is this light pink AB, and it's kind of in all the light pink areas of the floral arrangements around the edge. The H, which is the dark pink, is the same. It's the shadowing of these flowers all the way around him. The number five, which is this kind of purple tone, is all in his belly, um, under his face, the shading on his ears, and a little bit down the side. And then this F, which is the white, is all the edge of the panda, the tops of the flowers. I think that's going to be super cool. So that's where your ABs are. I mean, there's some pretty intense AB moonlight shining on the side of this panda that I reckon is going to look really good. So that is number one. I'm definitely pleased. £17. I reckon that's an absolute bargain. Um, really clear, really clear if I bring it up. Um, that's your drill field. Lovely, easy to read symbols. Nice and clear. You know, you can see that the blacks are a three. Uh, your plastic. It's quite thin, but that doesn't bother me. I think it's got a little bit of ink on the edge of the thing. It's dry though, it's just one of those things. Um, super sticky canvas, which is what we like to see. Um, and it's a nice, thick, soft backed canvas as well. They even have that bit of glitter to them that just be, reminds you of the Diamond Art Club canvases. It's got the nice scalloped edge, so it's not going to fray. Absolutely beautiful. He's already starting to flatten out nicely. I'm so pleased with that one. Right, number one down. Let's show you the other two. Okay, so here we have canvas number two. 
where this beautiful mountain range with the water and the tulips I just thought for a landscape that was really pretty again it's around it is 50 by 70 centimeters and um, so although these are they're pro and they are quite large they're not enormous and they are around so they're still you know once you've done a few quite a feasibly achievable project um so again, here we have one, two, five, ten, fifteen, twenty, twenty-five, thirty, thirty-five, forty. That one doesn't count because of that one. We've got forty colours to this one, and again, four of those are AB drills. So really quite interesting to see so many in these kits. Um, again, we have our little drill kit, uh, tool kit, drill kit, tool kit, you know. Um, you're getting, this time I got, is that the same two? Oh no, this time I got a diamond again, yes. <laughs> and a lining bolt. And the tape I got this time is this beautiful again white flowers with the lavender background and again i think that's really well matched to the canvas don't know if these are random or if you'll always get the same washi with a particular canvas or not but mine have turned out really well with the canvases so far i'm gonna pop those to one side we will take a look at our drills this is a lot of a lighter colour palette. We've got a lot of light blue, some white. We've got this kind of yellow green AB that's really pretty down there. We've got this red AB in here. I'm seeing an orangey brown, I think, AB back there. So we should have one more. And there's a pink, a pink AB as well. Beautiful plenty of drills um they're not diamond or club quality drills i mean they're not going to be for the price but their drills are actually pretty nice pretty consistent you know pretty clean their ab's are beautiful um i've not had any problems so far with their round drill quality i think for a cheaply affordable kit they're actually a very good um drill quality to them really pretty um nice uniform and clean they're not the fancy new resin ones but then they're not a fancy new price so i can live with that if you want to diamond paint more and more of a budget you know this this is a beautiful way to do it. So again, I'm going to pull that up onto my desk. So again, we have our beautiful canvas here. Um, so we have this kind of, um, whatever this symbol is, uh, I think is the reddish colour. And we're seeing that kind of across the bottom in these red patches and along here uh, then we've got this seven symbol here which is a pink and we're seeing that in the highlights of the flowers all the way along into the right hand side as well and a little bit across the tops like a glittering distant floral back there which should be make it look really nice this um Sorry guys, percentage sign here, or a divide sign, depends, depends. Um, that we're again seeing in the highlights of the flowers. I did find it earlier. Uh, yep, but over this side of the canvas in the flowers, um, this kind of reddish tone, I believe. A little bit over here as well. And then you've got this A, which is this kind of yellowy green. And that is, again, in the highlight of these ye more yellow flowers. We're seeing that pop up across the tops of these as well. 
So it's all your glitter is in the field down here in these beautiful flowers. So that is number two. I'll unpack and we will check out the last one that I got. I know it just had to be done. She is so beautiful. So I got this Day of the Dead lady here and uh, this, this is the artwork piece. Absolutely stunning. You all know I love a portrait and she is so different to any other ones I have so far. I had to grab her. You know I like something darker, a more gothic kind of content. There's nothing more so than a day of the dead lady. So, uh, And I just thought she was just really beautiful, stunning colours. She is fabulous. Again, I went for the pro size because I'm always going to do that. I'm always going to get a biggest sized canvas in what's available because you get the best detail with bigger sizes and you really do start to see them come alive when they're done because there's room for them to create a bigger artwork that therefore you can put more diamonds into and actually see some of the detail come to life and I'm really hoping she's going to reflect that when she's done because <laughs> I'll be really disappointed otherwise so she's the 50 by 70 pro set She's a round again, so nice and simple. We have one, two, three, four, five, so 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40 colours, and again we have four ABs. Can you believe? Can you believe these canvases for these prices? Um, so again, we've got our little toolkit. See what we get. Open her up. So it's got all the usual stuff in, and then I've got my two stickers. So this time I got a lightning ball and a swing. These are so cute and fun to do. This time I got this kind of more antique rose pattern in like a a peachy pink colour and to be honest in fact I do think it is again rather well suited to the colours of the diamond painting so I'm quite happy with that. This is of course a much darker colour palette. We're seeing uh, a blue AB in there, I've got a kind of a peachy orange AB here a red AB there. Can we find the fourth? Should have one more colour. I think that is actually another blue AB in there as well. We're a lot more kind of peachy, browny red. Beautiful. I know these darker colour palettes don't appeal to everyone, but uh, they're right up my alley and they are my favourites. Um, I don't know why, I just I really enjoy those colour tones. So again, we're going to pop her up on my desk and we will see if we can spot those ABs for you. Okay, so we have this radiation symbol here, which is kind of almost like where her eyeshadow would be and around the eyes. Um, yeah, just a little bit, just in here. Um, we've got this Q symbol here. And this is going to be this beautiful ethereal glow around the side, all this pale blue. So a little bit in the, um, the flower Kind of the, the leaves and the greenery is all blue from the look of it on this painting. So there's a little bit in there. Um, we've got this K, which is all kind of in the red glow of the background in the flowers themselves, the big flowers around her hair and kind of just in this background area, this lighter red here and coming up the side a tiny little bit. And then this kind of circle in circles in circles um, is all just a 
a little bit, just a little couple of pieces up in the flowers in the top of her hair. A little bit in the flowers just here. So just a couple of small pieces just dotted in the undersides of some of those flowers across the top. So I think they're going to make for really pretty placements. Just a little bit, not too much. I think the overarching piece is going to be this um, uh, blue, to be honest. I think that will be stunning, if I'm being honest. Um, some of this as well, this uh, whatever this is going to be, I'm seeing in the highlights of her hair as well quite a bit. I think it's going to be a bluish purple, like a shine. So you're going to see that in the hair and around her eyes, from what I can see. So they're going to turn out really, really beautiful. I am so pleased so far with the three kits I've got. Do not think that was a bad price at all for what I grabbed. I consider these quite a nice, achievable, not something that's going to take me a massive amount of time. I know they're larger. Um, but a 50 by 70 in a round is not so bad at all. Um, yeah, I think I think they're going to be so much fun. And I've got a feeling the 50 by 70 might be the whole canvas rather than the picture itself. I might be mistaken there. I don't have a ruler, uh, anything to measure with me at the moment to actually check that for you sorry guys um but either way they're stunning pieces they're well worth what i've paid for them and hopefully hopefully they're gonna um come out as as lovely as i'm hoping they're going to um i do have one completed kit by them the butterflies i have a kitting up and a post review on my channel so you can see kind of the quality of how that smaller kit came out if you're super interested in delving into theirs um you know it might help a little bit to see that company's um you know quality and style of render and such so yeah if you have any questions that i can help you with please pop them in the comments down below if you enjoyed the video give me a thumbs up how is your low by going or your hauls going this year are you doing well are you uh trying to maintain the stash <laughs> keep control of your hobbies and uh maybe failing a little bit like i am i'd love to know in the comments below and i'll see you in the next video thanks for watching